GuitarLessons.com, the number one name in guitar lessons online. Hey, welcome to GuitarLessons.com. In this lesson, we're going to learn another finger picking pattern for our right hand, and we're going to learn two variations on it. The first variation is going to be have a stationary bass note so you can really concentrate on just the right hand pattern. And the second chord progression that we're going to do changes chords where the, the root note changes bass strings and you can uh, get a little more involved with your thumb. So let me show you the first one and I'll explain to you what it's going on there. Okay, the basic pattern with our right hand is this right here is going to go thumb, index finger, middle, ring, and then back down, middle, index, and then start over the whole thing. And just keep looping that over and over again. Okay, for our left hand, it's real easy. Um, we have a kind of a partial A minor chord with our left hand. Our middle finger is going to be on the second fret D string. And our third finger is going to be on the second fret G string. And that's going to be our constant shape while just the bass note changes. So the first little bit has the open A in the bass. And then we're going to grab a C note on our A string with our pinky and play the same pattern. Then move the bass note down one fret. Come with your index finger on the second fret on your A string. And then you're going to go down one more fret with your index finger and let off with your middle finger. And then it just starts over again. Okay, now that you've got that pattern down with your right hand, we can go ahead and throw in another chord progression where the bass note changes strings and doesn't just stay on the same string, so it's a little bit more challenging for your thumb to know exactly where it's going in the pattern. So let me play it for you, then uh, we'll break it down just a little bit and see how it goes. Okay, it's the same pattern with your right hand, you're just changing where the bass note goes with your thumb. So the first chord we're playing there is a regular G major chord. You're going to start with your thumb on the low E string, that's your G note. And then your index finger, middle, and third will get the D, G, and B strings. Then you're going to move to a C chord, and your, these three fingers will stay on the same strings for this chord but your bass note changes up here to a C. You're going to play that chord shape in the same pattern with your right hand. Then you're going to move to an E minor chord, come down to the sixth string again to get your root note on your low E string. Keep your uh, top three strings the same strings. Now you've got to jump all the way up to the D string for your next chord, which is a D chord, and then your top three notes will be just the top three strings on the guitar. Then you're going to go back to the G. So take that pattern, apply it to whatever you want. I'm sure if you have some finger picking music that you like to listen to that that is going to be in a lot of different songs so you can just pick up those songs and use that and I'm sure you'll play psh, probably five or ten new songs just being able to do that pattern. 